Alright, so for the new series, what I'm going to be doing is, um, well, for the start of the new series, what I'm going to be doing for episode one is talking about myself. So yes, I did choose a mirror because I don't know. I just thought, you know, swag, swag. I don't know, but so basically, I had a uh, suggestions from I can't speak some suggestions from the group channel and all the people in it but instead of doing like minecraft or something like that or like dominic said and do some reviews on amazon i'll do some of those i will do some of those but instead what i'm gonna do is i am going to um talk a little bit about myself you know like because i think some of the newer people that joining uh, that are joining in because i mean we have 68 of you guys and girls, I'm sorry, I'm not trying to be like one gender specific, you know, but we have loads of you people, so it's like I said, it's gender friendly. I don't know why what I'm doing anymore. There's me, but uh, basically, a little bit about me, okay? Backstory: kid from Kentucky, from a town that. Oh Lord, you do not want to go to that town, though. I swear, since we've left, it's like it's gone to crap, you know? But, you know, like, that's every town now. No offense to anybody, but, I mean, it's true, sadly. Um, I'm 13. I was born on February 19th, 2004, in Litchfield or Louisville? I don't know where. But somewhere in Kentucky, and moved to. I can't remember where it was, but we had these apartment buildings, and then we moved from there, we moved to a couple other places I can't remember, because I have a really bad memory, because the only really thing I remember from when I was, like, little was a birthday party I had with a cousin of mine, and I can't remember what birthday party it was, I think it was his 10th or 8th birthday party, and we saw trash cans, and that's the only way I remember, it's because the trash cans, and it reminds me of that whole day. I can't really remember very much, you know. But honestly, I don't know what happened. I've just a lot of things have happened since then. So my brain's all fuzzy and crap of things. But uh basically after we moved around a couple times, I we went to Van Meter, which is when I started to go to Clarkson. I want to say is then. I don't I can't remember. Then we moved to another trailer while I was still in Grayson, like the Grayson Clarkson area, Clarkson Grayson area, there we go. And then went to middle school in Grayson County from where I lived in Big Clifty, which is a small town. It's not even technically, you can't even classify it as a town, but they do. But, um, and then I moved there. And then from then on, you know, uh, I started going to Grayson. I stayed in the same school district, you know, and, um, basically what all happened was some stuff went down with family. Not going to say exactly what happened in this video, maybe in another video, I don't know, but basically some things went down during my seventh grade year. So as soon as it hit, like, basically halfway through my seventh grade year, we moved down here to Oklahoma. With it was just me and my mom. My dad still stayed up in Kentucky. Some things happened, you know. Um, basically, like I said, some things some things happened, you know. Um, then we got down here. It's been pretty hard being down here, you know. Not trying to get used to some people. Of course, y'all know that I have a, at least a couple friends, you know. Because or I wouldn't be invited to this group channel. I wouldn't be helping out with this group channel with some guys I know. You know what I mean? Um, so basically, just, just like I said, it's just been pretty hard, you know. But that's how life goes. Life throws some curves at you sometimes. And just got to be the better person and suffer through it, you know. And then you get some people that help you out in the beginning. And then once you start going out and doing stuff for your own they always wanted they always were used to you piggybacking off them and then they wanted to go and ditch you you know um this is actually what we're going through now but it's not the point 
pretty sure they watch my videos anyways, but if they do, I don't care. No, honestly. But it's kind of weird looking myself in this mirror, you know, because the way I look on camera is a lot, a lot like brighter than it is actually in the mirror. So if I see, like y'all see myself there, now look at myself in the mirror. See, it's a lot darker, you know. I don't know. That's weird. Thought I'd just steer off the video, but I didn't. But um, like I said, you know, some things happen in life, and whenever those things happen, you know, you just gotta be the better person and be like, I don't know how to put it, like, not be the complete jerk like everybody's expecting you to turn into, you know, because everybody's probably like, not including your family, you know, but like the people that are messing you over, you know. They might just want you to be, like, all act up and crap. You don't want to act up, you know. You want to try to help your family out as much as you can. And the more you help out, the more it'll show, like, towards your character, you know. Because the meaning of character that we learned in engineering is character is an inward motivation to do what is right in every situation regardless of the circumstances according to the highest set of behavioral standards. Basically, what that means is whatever you do in life, well, this is my personal opinion what it basically means. It, it means like whatever you do in life, it'll come back and help you out whenever um, you need it. Like, let's say, oh, you had a family you know, you had a really bad thing happen in your family. Like, your parents separated or something like that. And they're not treating, like, everybody's just not treating each other properly, you know. Yeah, it might not really help you out a lot. But, you know, whenever you get older, you're like, oh, hey, let's not make the same decisions that so-and-so made, you know. And it'll help you build a better relationship with whoever, whoever you marry or you, whoever you get engaged to, you know. But honestly, if you're getting engaged to somebody, I'd rather you go ahead and finish out the marriage, you know. Or if you honestly just don't like the person, then why'd you get engaged with them in the first place, you know? Like, y'all should remember Bailey. Some things happen with Bailey in a relationship, you know. And the guy went back and got together with her again because he felt bad for her. Don't do that, dudes. Like, any guys out there, if you do that, that's just... That's just pure messed up, you know? Honestly. If you do that, it's, it's like you're hurting the, f the female of that relationship. Because you're not actually showing them your full support. You just feel bad for them. So you're like, oh, let me get back to with them. You know? There is a kid standing outside. That's so weird. Okay. They probably just listen to me talk. I don't care. You guys can look. If you guys find me, you know, you can listen to me talk and do videos. You can guys can, I'm not saying go find me, you know, I'm not saying that. I'm just like, if you ever bump into me one day, just like, hey, can I get a picture with you? Sure, I'll give you a picture. But, you know, once I get up there in the ranks, if I ever do, I doubt it though. If I ever get up there, then all of y'all are surrounding me at once, you know. I might just take one big group selfie. You guys all get behind me because it's hard doing individual pictures of over like 4,000 of you guys surrounding me. Like what happened with Jake and Logan, you know. Honestly, I think it was just Logan, but they're not me, you know. Yeah, they're, those two are going back and forth at it with diss tracks and crap, but some of those, they actually mean it, you know. They say, oh, I don't mean it. But if you just watch the way they act towards each other, you can see that they don't really like each other as brothers, as they say they do. You can tell that there's some, like, relationship problems there with them. I don't know, but that, like that, like I said, this is besides the point. That's in a, that's for another video's conversation, you know. It's supposed to be about me. This thing is supposed to be about Logan Paul and Jake Paul. I mean, for all I care, they can go do whatever they need to do. It's been six minutes or nine minutes. Nine minutes, okay. So, honestly, guys, like I was saying, this is this turned from being about me to about you guys, you know. And every time I say you guys, I don't mean like all oh, the guys in specific, like specifically, I mean like you people basically. Like, <laughs> it's hard to explain, you know. I just I just say bro and dude a lot. So, like, I say bro and dude a lot to a lot of females and males, you know. And some of them, 
or like I'm not a dude. I'm just like I'm sorry. It's a habit because I'm used to being able to like communicate that way with some people I know, especially Bailey because she just makes fun of it a lot. She like makes fun of me like don't call me a dude. I'm not a bro, you know. So I just like. So I'm start, gonna start putting back, oh, so you're not in the bro army, you know, hitting towards PewDiePie, but I, I'm just messing with it. I'm just messing with people. I'm not about all that high life, oh, I'm the thirsty for the attention and views. No, I'm not about that. I just, like I said, like I said in a lot of my videos, I just do this for fun, guys. I don't do it for the money. Heck, I don't even have an AdSense account anymore because I realized I filled it out wrong even when I tried to. And then I was like, you know what, screw it. Just went ahead and deleted all of the progress I made on it. And it's like, you know what, I'm not even going to turn that on yet. So, it's not about, like, I've, I don't know why I keep swiping at the camera. It's not about the money, guys. I mean, I asked Tyler today because I realized that for some reason the AdSense thing is sent into some random account, you know? So I texted Tyler, he's like, dude, don't lie to me. Where are you getting the money? Like, where's the money going if we do start getting money from it? He was like, the AdSense thing ain't even working. I'm like, yeah, I know, but then why is your AdSense account accepted, you know? But I'm just, I don't even know what I'm rambling about anymore. So, guys, I'm going to go ahead and edit this video together. I'm going to try to use iMovie. Not sponsored, sadly. Nobody will sponsor me, you know? But I'm going to end this video off by saying, guys and girls, just be you, please. Do this world a favor, and instead of hurting people, start helping people, you know? Just just do more that you can to help instead of hurt, you know? Because the more you hurt, the world, the more the world will come to an end, you know? If, you, if, you're, hint, if you're picking up what I'm throwing down, you know what I mean? That, that was two different phrases I just used in one sentence. That was, <laughs> wow, okay, I'm pretty tired, but I don't care, you know? It's not about quantity on YouTube, it's more about quality. But some YouTubers don't realize that. They think it's more about quali uh, quantity instead of quality. No. It's, it, your viewers, yeah, they want some more videos posted. Like then and there, you're supposed to be on that specific deadline. You know, you got some of those people like that. Then you got the nice people that are like, dude, take your time. Upload whenever you can. Just make it about the quality. Because the better the quality is, the more people that will come and watch your videos. If, you, if you're, like I said, if you're picking up what I'm throwing down, you know, honestly, my videos quality ain't that good at all. My quantity of videos ain't that good at all. Uh, good at all. Heck, half my 150 some odd videos I have ain't even real videos. They're like canceled videos I had to do because my internet started crapping out that day, you know? So I actually tried to go through there and start deleting it. It's just, I have over probably 130 videos uploaded that aren't the ones that canceled on me. I think the other 20 or 10 or 15 of them, I don't know how many there is, are just um, canceled videos. So, what I'm going to do, guys, I'm going to go ahead and leave this video here. I got to save some storage up for the next episode of this and the 34th vlog. I know I said I'd do something very special for the 30th vlog. Just guys, I haven't had the chance to. Please, please bear with me. The more you guys bear with me, the more I can post and realize, hey, you guys are actually wanting to watch, you know? Because I know there's about that group of 10 people that always comes back, you know? Always wants to watch my videos. Which, I thank you guys for that. That group there that always comes back to all my videos that you can watch, like, just comes back and continues slow showing me support, you know? Those are the people I like. Those are the people that I say, hey, you want to come and meet me one day? I'll fly you down here or something like that if I ever get that hot. I'm not saying I would do that, but not saying I won't do that, you know? It's like if some special event's happening, you know? And then I get a message saying, hey, I would like to go to that meeting. I just don't have enough money to do that. Or they explain a situation to where they can't go to it. Now, if I'm up there, you know, it's kind of hard to do that now because you know I just it's hard to explain you know but uh what I'm gonna do guys I'm gonna go ahead and end this video here I will see you guys in the next video I am sorry for the past few videos my intro has not been in the videos it's just not one to cooperate with me so I'll see you guys
in the next video. Peace.